Hi guys, this is Kefren, your favorite French Canadian. Today I'm gonna do a small video about Adobe Access, uh, something that I just found on the Windows Store. Um, it's an application that you can download. You can try it for free if you want, or you can buy it. It's $13 uh, Canadian. And um, you can activate if you want Dolby Atmos on your headphones or your speaker. Even if your hardware is not technically compatible with Atmos, you can do it uh, manual, like just with the software and it will like emulate the Dolby Atmos. At first, I was not like very <laughs> sure about it. I had like previous experience with like Logitech, uh, Razer, like pretty bad. Like you're getting a nice surround when you're playing a solo game, but when you're you're uh, talking to your friend on Discord, like everything seems weird. And a multiplayer game also, it's not very good. So I decided to just test the application. So I just bought it. You open it, you're gonna get uh, a screen like this. So first of all, if you want to test it, they have a couple of demo uh, that you can definitely uh, test. Uh, if you're not sure if you want to buy it, me, I'm using an Sennheiser HD 599, and I was really impressed. Uh, they show you like with and without, and for me, with was a lot better. So I was at start, I, I was like thinking, oh, maybe it's just good for movies. No, when I apply it for music, gaming and movies everything sounds a lot better and i was really impressed like what you can do with 13 dollars so let's start with the product so the first thing that you need to select is do you want to activate them for headphones or speaker depending on your setup also i want to mention when you buy it on the windows store it will also be uh compatible on your xbox i currently have an xbox series x and i can't use i can use now the application on my console so it's very good I'm using it with for uh, Bose speaker 2.1 and also it's a lot better when I play video games with it so after that in the setting we're gonna start with the first one so if you want to play video game you have to enable it in the game mode I recommend to play the performance mode uh, the performance mode prioritize positional accuracy for competitive gaming so make sure this one is at on don't use the intelligent equalizer it's not very good so I did the test first of all on solo game uh, and I was really impressed it was a lot better also I did test on a solo game that's not compatible with Dolby Atmos and also it was better so this is pretty good for solo games so now I did a couple of tests for multiplayer I played game like Warzone um, on Showdown uh, and also super people so I want to I want to know like multiplayer uh, competitive game like is it good or not and it was also for me a lot better more clear sound more loud also I really enjoy the game feature on the Dolby one so definitely you should definitely test it depending on your uh, headset uh, I did a couple of tests on Sennheiser headset I have two and I have three different model here and they all sound better so maybe just test it first and after that you will see if uh, you like it for the movie you have to enable it uh, for me also it was a lot better I don't like to use the intelligent equalizer I did a couple of tests like the detail the balance and the warm didn't like it so just put the intelligent equalizer at off but enable it when you watch a movie for sure if the movie is compatible with Dolby Atmos it will also be better the other one is the music this one I was kind of surprised also because my previous experience with software like that, when you listen uh, to music, it's pretty trash when you use that. And with this, I was really impressed again. I don't like the intelligent equalizer, so just put this one at off, apply it. My sound look it sounds crisp. Um, also, it's a, it was a little bit louder for me. Uh, so on, on my Sennheiser HD 599, it sounds really amazing. You have the voice one that I'm not using it and you have three custom profile that you can like select by yourself and do whatever that you need to do if you want to like change Earths and stuff like that. If you want like the surround virtualizer and the volume leveler. Uh, I'm not using it. Honestly, right now on my PC, I'm using the music one in the game. I don't watch any movie on my PC. It's more on my TV. Uh, but uh, for now, the gaming mode is really good and the music one, it's really good with my Spotify account. So this is pretty much it guys for $13, it's really good and also you can definitely test it before, you, you can use 
the trial version to make sure that do you like it or not if you like it you just have to buy it and it will improve your sound a lot on your computer if you have any question just comment in the youtube section post me like any question about the software itself or whatever your headphones or whatever and i will try to help you the best that i can and don't forget to subscribe to the channel peace